track wrestling here in Rochester, Minnesota at the JJ Classic with two-time Junior World Champion, NCAA Champion Mark Hall. Mark, a couple weeks from now you're going to be wrestling the NWCA All-Star Classic yeah. against Zahid Valencia. Uh, how did the process go? How did the match get lined up? Uh, I imagine national champions got first chance yeah. at the match. What, what were you looking for in a matchup? Uh, I don't know. Coach Kale came up to me one day and asked me if I wanted to wrestle in it. Um, uh, we just had to make sure like everything went well and traveling and stuff like that. And it was over a good time to wrestle. So uh, yeah, uh, basically one day he said, let's wrestle the All-Star Classic. And so lined it all up. I didn't know who I would be wrestling or when. Um, and then you know now that it's all lined up, I got a really good guy that uh, I'm familiar with. So. Yeah, you're going to wrestle Zahid Valencia, Arizona State. Uh, obviously, a lot of talk about the semifinal last year. How far back does the series go with him? How, how long have you been scrapping against Zahid? Get out of here. Um, and so, so I have uh, I've wrestled with him since I was a kid. And um, let's see, like seven or eight. Really? And so uh, I had never beat him <laughs> until last year in the semifinals. And then but for every world team we made together, he was my go-to warm-up partner. So uh, we're real familiar with each other. We've wrestled our whole lives. I've known him my whole life. Uh, his family, uh, his brother I wrestled even. So just real familiar with them. Uh, it'll be fun. It's another, another match to add to the series. You've won tons and tons of wrestling matches throughout your life. Uh, to get over the hump against somebody that, that had had your number prior to that. What did that do for you? What was that like? Um, I think, you know, I mean, I don't want to make too big of a deal of it, but I mean, it's just another stepping stone. Um, that was a big part, a part of my uh, career, I think, is just guys that I have trouble beating. I don't, I haven't normally got over the hump. So uh, making that happen in a big stage uh, was pretty cool. And, and so, uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta keep doing that. If, if it's only once, then um, it doesn't really mean much. So you gotta, you gotta keep building. I gotta keep getting better. Um, but definitely, just the All Star Classic. I'm just looking to wrestle as hard as I can. Um, it's not gonna count against me or for me. So uh, if that's the case, then I don't really have anything to lose. So I'm just really excited to compete. Uh, it was a tournament. It was a well, I guess a duel or whatever it is. Uh, I've watched since I was a kid, so I'm really excited to be a part of it now. Have you gone back and watched that semifinal match much? Not too much. Uh, I know, um, I mean, maybe like right after it, uh, I was still at the NCAAs, um, but no, I actually haven't watched it in a while. Uh, I know, because just like how it had happened, um, it was actually kind of kind of hard for me to watch even like if it like if that's how people think I was gonna win then like I want to make sure that it doesn't come down to something like that next time I want to make sure if I'm gonna win I want to win the right way um, and he's probably the same thing if he's gonna I guess lose he wants to lose the right way and it, this sucks how it happened but um, yeah I haven't really watched it too much just focusing on the next thing uh Obviously, the, the huge difference in size the last couple summers when you, you guys were on world teams together. Were you surprised Zahid went back down to 74 again? Um, not really, just because uh, I was able, just being with them over the summers, uh, last few summers, like I've seen like, on like, what he weighs on the scale. And it's hard to believe, but people, like he's got, like he's got a really big uh, upper body. But his lower half isn't that big. He's got kind of skinny legs, so I told him that. It's not like I'm gonna. Know. But uh, yeah, he's he's not. He's he's strong. He's real strong, but he's not. Uh, he's not too much off bigger than me. So, um, but yeah, he's definitely got. He's got a good frame, and so uh, 184 or whatever weight he ended up going, good weight for him. But uh, you know, he just happened to be. Same, uh, same weight again. So whatever it is, it doesn't matter. Whoever they put in front of me, I gotta wrestle seven minutes and wrestle hard. So uh, whether it's him or whether it was anyone else at the weight class, I'm just excited to be able to wrestle. Uh, yeah, also 
Did you give any thoughts to U23? No. It was just too much of a turnaround with school. Uh, and with that, I got asked that first before I was asked wrestling. Or I got asked to wrestle at the All-Star Classic before I was thinking about going to U23. So basically, peaking for the All-Star Classic and then U23 and then U23 Worlds, it would just be too hard. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I've just been focused on that, on the All-Star Classic. Haven't had a chance to talk to you since the new weights came out for freestyle. What are your thoughts? It's exciting. Yeah. I don't have to make 163 anymore <laughs> until the, the Olympic year, at least. We'll see when that comes around. But yeah, 174, it's like perfect for me, right? So I can make it for the college season and then turn around, freestyle season starts up. All the same. So uh, yeah, it was, it was really exciting and relieving. Uh, cutting weight sucks. And, uh, <laughs> Just get a, now I get to wrestle and not, not worry about my weight too much, just have fun and compete uh, hard with some tough tough guys, I mean the seniors now. So. 2020 obviously a long way off still, but have you given that much thought on whether up or down? Or? No, no. Uh, it just kind of depends on what I'm weighing. Uh, I mean, some people get injuries and um, they end up losing a lot of weight, some people get injuries and they end up gaining a lot of weight. Some people, uh, it just depends on how my body will uh, end up, so we'll see. I'm not sure yet.